All right, what is going on, everybody? Today we're here with the Pokemon Sword and Shield Crown Dungeon Ranked Doubles video. And today I'm here with a really super mega lit Bear Tick team. Uh, so my idea behind this team is that I lead off with Indeedy Bear Tick. I go for the uh, Swords Dance, and I can then go crazy after going into Nine Tails with the Indeedy slot. Or I could lead Bear Tick Colossal and activate Steam Engine, which is a very unique strategy that no one's ever done before. So hopefully we can uh, put in some work with that, but we'll see. Uh, anyways, this is the team, and I will be back into the first battle. Okay, this first battle is interesting because they have a Tyranitar with no actual Sand Abuser on their team because the, the, that lander does not get Sand Force, it's the other one that gets Sand Force. Okay, um, that's kind of really annoying actually because it can, it can change my weather. But I think I might be able to deal with that. I'm gonna go with Bear Tick and Didi, I believe. Uh, they do have Earthquake. They don't really actually. They have Celesteela. Ooh. Okay. Um, it's not that bad if they don't. They have no redirection. I could just go Colossal. But they have a lot that really hurts Colossal. Hmm. I'm gonna go Bear Tick and Didi, Nine Tails, and I'm gonna bring I think Swamper in the back. It's pretty strong here overall. I'm gonna go with that, yeah. I'm probably gonna regret not going Colossal, but I, I wanna show up Bear Tick at least once because Colossal's kinda generic, you know? Everyone everyone knows what Colossal does, right? So I'm trying to see if I can uh, make the Bear Tick do the work in this game, but it might actually cost me, but whatever, we'll be fine. Okay, there's also one downside to this team is I do have Indeedee, so I can't go for the uh, Aqua Jet against opponents super easily, unless like a Flyer or whatever, but um. I still think it's like worth uh, having a DD because of the, the terrain prints fake out and stuff, which is super lit. Also prevents sucker punch from these two demons. Okay. Um, Cinderace is faster than Urshifu. Hmm. That's really not good. Okay. <laughs> That's really bad, actually. Um. I'm gonna go for the Swords Dance, and I will go for the Follow Me, but I might outright lose here. Two really strong Dark types right off the bat's really bad. Uh, <laughs> yikes, because the Sinners can just max Darkness me, and Oko and Didi, and then the Urshifu can just punch Bear Tick and Oko that, and then I lose. Oh, this is really not good. Oh, this is really bad. Maybe they flared, predicting nine tails. Hopefully they flared, predicting nine tails. That would be litty. I'd be vibing with that choice. Please do that. Flare me right now. That's cool too. Okay, that works too. Um, anything but uh, <laughs> but dark is there. So they probably don't have sucker punch. Then they did over half, which doesn't matter because they're gonna kill them with the Urshifu anyways. But now I can go into Nine Tails pretty free. They they definitely predicted Nine Tails just there, or they were going for the uh, Bear Tick for some reason with Steel Spike. When their entire moves that hits it anyway, super effectively. Okay, uh, I'm gonna go Nine Tails here. I should be able to handle the Urshifu with Nine Tails. I shouldn't have to hit the uh, Cinderace at all. Also, it'll be faster anyways. So. I really regret not having superpower right now. I didn't really consider the uh, idea of uh, uh, steel types. <laughs> I don't know why. All right, Nine Tails should honestly probably scare out the Urshifu. Maybe I have no idea, but I <sighs> a Max Geyser is not gonna KO. Hmm. And it would it would take my speed away. <sighs> what a rough scenario. I really wish I had superpower now, but I couldn't really afford that. I should have gone with superpower over uh, liquidation, honestly. Hmm. Maybe I'll just liquidation the Cinderace and go for the Moonblast into the Urshifu, and not waste my Dynamax and just save it for Swampert. They did withdraw! No! I could have blizzarded, bro! 
I could- Oh, my weather's gone. Oh, I forgot about the T-Tar. Right. That's such a bad scenario, bro. Why do they have to have a T-Tar? That's super whack. And they kill Bantic, yeah. Why- Why did they have to have a random T-Tar on their team? Who does that? With- with no Sandrush user? That's so random. And it sucks. It's like the worst- Like-, like that's like random Torkoal on your team with no with no Venusaur. Like, what are you gonna do with Torkoal? I definitely can't win this game. I don't think. Like, Swamper might put in some work, but now they have a plus two T-Tar, and it's just like you know. Um. God, that sucks so much. Why? <laughs> Why is that what they had to have for their team? Why did the lead? Well, to be fair, they didn't darkness and DD. Um, but, like, Iron Head Cinderace is unfortunate, and, like, also the fact of, uh, the T-Tar, bro. That's the worst. That's the worst. Okay, I'm glad I didn't max the bear tick at the very least. I almost max guarded it, but that would have been a waste. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go... Hmm. I should have just gone Colossal, bro. Honestly. <laughs> just turn one, Oko the... I guess Cinderace? Yeah, I would have Oko Cinderace for sure. Done damage to Urshifu, broken the thing. Going on Nine Hills afterwards, broken it and killed it with the Moonblast. I can... Quake? No, I'm gonna... I'm gonna Geyser. That, I'm gonna Moonblast. Click faster! Buttons! Oh my god. The Sandstorm makes the UI lag. And it's really annoying, bro. Like, whenever the, um... There's, like, there's too much going on at once. Like, too much weather, too many... Uh, like, like, really big animated Pokemon, like, sometimes Dynamax, Moltres does it as well. The, the UI lags, and I hate it. Hopefully the Moonblast went through, I, I think it did. Otherwise, I just Blizzard, which is fine as well. A Steel Spike 9 does, I'm assuming. Yeah, whatever. <sighs> that's so irritating. <laughs> that's such an irritating matchup, I hate that. Okay. So, I did not get to show off Bandic how I wanted to in this battle, but that's... It happens, I guess, right? It happens. I'm so disappointed, though! I thought it was... Like, like literally, I went into this thinking, Wow, this team really can 4-0 anybody. I can just easy win any battle. And then... They had a T-Tar, bro. <laughs> they had a Weather Changer. Oh, my God. Oh my god. Like, a, 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 a typical sand team I can handle because they're more predictable. But they specifically had T-Tar in the back without also relying on the weather themselves. Like, they didn't need the weather, right? They had no need for sand. It was only there to get rid of my weather, and I hate that. Okay. I'm gonna... Geyser, the Urshifu, it's probably Sash. They might be banded, I have no idea. Um, I don't think there's a chance at this point, though. Unless they, like, miss a high jump kick, but they bounced. Okay. Well, that- I, I can't get bounced, but that's pretty litty. <laughs> I- I can't get hit by that, because I have, uh, protect, so... And they wicked blow. Are you choice banded? Yes, you are. That means you die here. Hmm... There might be a chance, honestly. If- if they don't have high jump kick, then there's a chance. They're banded, right? They have to be. Yeah, okay. I'm pretty sure they were banded. That did way too much damage. Um... Celesteela? So the issue here is I have to guys that to kill. I, I have to dodge a bounce here. If I don't guys it in the rain, I'm not gonna kill it ever. Actually, I'm torn boosted. I might. I wouldn't Oko it, though. I, I won't Oko without a max, but we have to go for it. Just dodge! Dodge the bounce! Why didn't you dodge the bounce? But you lived the bounce! Don't get paralyzed! Let's go! Okay. Okay. We killed Celesteel, which is super lit. All we have to do is beat one Cinderace, okay? Now, they could bounce me. They could high jump kick me. They could iron head me, or they could pyro ball me. And the issue is is that all of those kill. And that sucks. Um, I think Torrent boosted in the rain. Oh, they were flying through right now anyway. I can't risk the uh, ground move. I'll just go for it. Maybe the, if they hijack, I'm mad. They bounced again. Oh, okay. That's the game we're playing. Okay. 
So I can either go for the 15% chance of instant victory, or I could protect and see what they do after where just, they would just iron head me. Like, if I protect, I die to iron head guaranteed next turn. So I don't think I can afford it. And I just explained why I'm not going to protect. So if you comment saying, bro, why didn't you protect in that battle? That's why. Because they would just go for Iron Head and kill me. I have 20 HP. Thank you. I swear to God, bro. I will explain. They didn't miss. Oh, they missed. Oh, shoot. 15%. Hey, yo. Sucks, nerd. You, they have plus two defense, though. Yeah, I knew I was. Oh, okay. So that was kind of lit. <laughs> Okay, that was kind of lit, but like, I swear, I, I explain stuff in a video, and I always get comments repeating exactly what I explain as if they came up with it originally, and it's so weird to me. I don't get that. I don't get that. Like, I always, like, watch a full video before I comment on videos. I also just don't comment on videos, so <laughs> I can't say much. Maybe they'll high jump kick me. High jump kick. Maybe they just didn't want to breed egg moves, so they probably don't have it. They bounced again? Yeah, I'm going for it. Heck you. <laughs> uh, protect. Heck you. No, not, not today, buddy. Not today. Why are they not iron-headed me yet? I should have just attacked. Whatever. Miss? If they miss, I'm screwed. Okay, no. It didn't matter anyways then. Why? Why were... Why were you... Sp are you choice scarfed? Why were you spamming bounce? That battle was way closer than it had any right to be, and it was entirely their own fault. Why did they spam bounce? Why is Swampert so lit? Yeah, wait, were you choice scarfed? Yes, you were! Oh my god. They really did not want to add egg moves, which are the best moves it gets. Like, you really want... Why? They turn one Dynamax. <laughs> they turn one Dynamax, they're Scarf Cinderace. Which was entirely unnecessary. They didn't have to do it. Alright, that's weird. Anyways, uh, I will be back when we get into the next battle. Oh. Okay. I'm not... So they have Incineroar. They have the, the, the top of the meta. They have the Pokemon, right? They have Incin. The rest of their team? Really weird. And I'm probably about to get gimmicked out of my mind. Because something's going to happen right now. They're going to like... I don't know. Like, There's Magic Bounce, Espeon. There's all kinds of stuff right now. I have no idea what's going to happen. Um, but I do believe their lack of spread moves is... Ah, they have Heat Wave on Volcarona. Um, I have a plan for Heat Wave, actually. I have a plan for Heat Wave, actually. Will I screw myself over by not having Rillaboom or Swamper? I don't think so. Colossal should be able to handle it. I'm gonna go with these mods. I'm gonna try and avoid maxing Bear Tick at all costs. Because Colossal boosts are not still does some damage, right, with the with Volklith. So my idea is that I lead in DD Bear Tick, right? And if they lead Volcarona, I go for I, or I, I, uh, I go for follow me and hard swap Colossal. If they heat, maybe get the boost for the, the speed. Or if they kill in DD, then I get to go into Bear Tick afterwards in Aqua Jet. Volcarona, okay. Um, the instant's kind of tough, but they can't pick me out, so it's fine. Um. I'm actually not worried about, like, I guess instant could go like, close combat if they have it. They wouldn't close combat though, right? I think I'm gonna go with the Colossal. Yeah, I'm gonna follow me. Just to avoid a random close combat <laughs> into my my Colossal. I'm gonna go hard Colossal right now. Bertic can come play later, right? not right now. <laughs> not right now. The real Pokemon are about the battle. So I might not get to show off what I wanted to with Bear Tick. I have been completely bodied by Bear Tick in the past, so it's, uh... <laughs> I was hoping to do that to them today, but that's not gonna happen, I guess. The issue is that Max Geyser sets the weather to a one that you don't want, which is not great, so you can't really go for it. You didn't... Holy mother of God! Uh-huh. Holy Christ! They made their final mistake. GG's. <laughs> hey, good game. Um, 
I have two options here. I can go to Nine Tails instead of the Veil. Since I currently Oko them anyways. Or I can go into Bear Tick and Aqua Jet for policy. But I currently Oko them anyways and already got Steam Engine. I did get Steam Engine, right? They, they Flare Blitzed me, so I should have gotten Steam Engine, right? I believe so. I was not prepared for the Volcarona to Oko my Ndidi, but I forgot that I don't have my Psychic Seed anymore. Um, I have goggles because I didn't want to get slept by Venusaur. I, that, 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 the, the plan I'm doing right now was my plan for the Sun matchup. Because like, the idea was that I would lead a DD Bear Tick. And if they led Charizard, I would go Colossal. If they led Venusaur, I would follow me and set up. That was the idea. But uh didn't happen. I did get Steam Engine, right? I'm fast. I'm fast. Okay. Um, In that case, I go for the Veil and I go for the... Max Volklith into Volcarona. If they swap out, I really don't care. I'm not worried about Insin. Maybe I should be worried about Insin. I'm not worried about Volcarona, actually. It's not a threat to me whatsoever. Like, what's the worst they could do is, like, Max Mindstorm me in the terrain? That would kind of suck, actually. I don't see them maxing in this scenario, though. Not with Colossal right there. There's no way, right? It wouldn't make sense. Alright, Colossal, do what you do best. Pop off! Okay, well that worked out. <laughs> There's that. So, the only issue now is Volcarona, which I, uh, at most is going to heat wave me, right? But I already have the Veil up, so... Then I can go into Bear Tick in the, tr in the hail and just pop off with that. We're in a good spot right now. I wish you O-Code me, honestly. That would have been better. <laughs> if you killed Nine Tails, that would have been even better for me. We're in a good spot right now. This worked out. My, my lead plan worked out pretty well. I like that. That's pretty cool. Okay. What is your next Mon, Clown? What is your next plan of action? Hmm. I don't even remember what they had. They like bolt hunt and stuff, right? They had Espeon. Neither would work here. <laughs> Neither would save them here. Which one's that? Articuno! Okay. Not a bad choice, but not a good choice. Honestly, I'm just gonna double it, yeah. Because they're probably gonna max it, if I had to guess. Or they might max Volcarona, but even then, like, what's that gonna get them? They can't kill Colossal anymore. The battle's been over since, the, since I sent it out, to be honest. Did they even have a good check for it on Team Preview? I don't think so. Like, Bolton loses to it, Volcarona loses to it, Articuno loses to it, Incineroar loses to it. I don't think they had an option for it. That's probably Volcarona, but I blizzarded it in Volklith for a reason, so. Or Articuno, rather. It's something Articuno. I respect the attempt! You're pretty cool there, buddy. If they're policy, I'm mad as heck. But I don't think they would be. Also, I don't think they'll live anyways. Oh my god! <laughs> what do I know? <laughs> Honestly, what do I know? Ninetales, you don't do much damage normally! Okay, we're good. It, Ninetales is really weak. I was worried about that one. We're good. We're good. We, we, we got it. We got it. We, we got through it. See, this is what I wanted the team to do, is to just pop off regardless. But that didn't really happen. And they missed Ninetales. <laughs> That's so tragic. Okay. Uh, are they just going to die to Volklip plus Hail? No, they won't die. They'll live a little bit. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> This is what I wanted the team to do, but Bantic's not doing anything right now. <laughs> it it should have been the last game, but unfortunately it just didn't happen. They had Titar. Um, yeah, at this point they probably just concede. If I had to guess. I didn't even need the policy boost, like actually. I just went crazy. They protected the Espeon, but for what? I guess you uh, you don't get my, like, you, you can't get hit by my move anymore, my vocal. You can get the Heat Wave instead. by Volcarona. Yeah, they, I think they just died next turn to Heatwave plus, uh... 
plus uh, Moonblast. Or actually, no, no, it's Blizzard is a single target now, so it's fine. It's still good to go. It also might just be stronger, anyways, regardless of Moonblast or regardless of uh, targeting. Okay. Bro, this Colossal went in just now. As it, as it does, it, it's Colossal. Like, if I was them, I would be really mad right now, like, being like, oh, your team is so cool, but you bring Colossal and win with Colossal? That sure is lame. That's what I would say. But I'm not them, so. <laughs> they probably have much better sport than I am. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a not very good sport. All right, well, that battle went very well. I respect the uh, non-forfeiting. Maybe they're hoping for like a super crazy critical hit expanding force or something, which actually probably would have won the game. Not gonna lie, if, if, if I missed my heat wave and Blizzard somehow didn't kill, I might have lost, to be honest. Maybe, I don't know. Anyways, um, I will be back when I get into the next battle. You know, I actually showcased three of these mods very close together. Scizor, Dedenne, and Kangaskhan. <laughs> I used them all very close together, like, 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 you know, in videos that were like around the same time. Um, I'm not too sure what to expect. Dedenne could be entrainment plus into Rotom Heat, I guess. I don't really know. Um, I really don't know. But notably, they don't have a weather setter. And they have spread move. Okay. They have a they have they have they have Primarina for spread moves, which I think Bear Tick lives anyways. It should definitely live at least one. Um so I'm gonna go with the Bear Tick strat and just pray. <laughs> Honestly, that's, that's gonna be my entire goal. Uh I need Colossal for Sizzle, I think. And for Rotom. Man, this is definitely a Colossal game, huh? There's no way they would bring Garchomp versus Hail though, which is pretty good for me because it's the, like their best Pokemon. I'm gonna bring Colossal. I'm probably gonna regret it too. I, I, I kind of want Swamper. I'm not gonna lie, but Colossal should put in work as well. Let's do it. Let's do it. If anything, I can do the same play as I did last time. If the lead is something I don't expect, right? Oh, do they have to bring Garchomp for Colossal? Oh, that sucks, bro. That's really tough. Cause I'm a Hail team with Colossal. Which means it's really bad for their Garchomp being their best Colossal check. That's crazy. Okay. Hold on. Okay. And they like Garchomp too. Oh ho ho ho! Oh ho ho ho! I can't even see that the dead It's so trash and so tiny, bro. Oh, I forgot about Earthquake. Don't say floating on a balloon. Do not say floating on a balloon. You're not on a balloon! Cool. Okay. So that means that to protect the dead Earthquake, but I would live anyways. So I'm just gonna follow me. And Swords Dance. That might be risky. I could just, I could just hailstorm honestly, and get the hail up myself. No, I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it. I'm half expecting them to rock fall, indeed. So that the 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 sand up. I would not put it past them. I really want uh, indeed to die this turn. That'd be like super optimal. Can Cleffa get follow me? That's what I should do if I really want the Mon to die turn one. I should like get like a Sash Cleffa. They swapped out Chomp into Primarina. Okay. Um, I do not have Freeze Dry. That was actually the point in Rillaboom being on the team. So I didn't really think it through. <laughs> I I didn't really think that through, I'm not gonna lie. I I, I meant to bring Rillaboom. Or I should have brought Rillaboom, because I kind of just didn't, like, like in my mind, I brought Rillaboom for Feeny. And I just didn't acknowledge that Primarina is the same exact thing. But more annoying. Um. Okay, okay. Uh, this is fine. I'm going to max Hailstorm them and follow me. I'm going to max Hailstorm the Primarina as well. Come plus two. I'm not going to go nine tails right now. It's it, I don't want to. I don't want to get paralyzed. All right, what's your play, buddy? If they if they actually are plus entrainment, they can't max, and they didn't max Primarina, which is really good. Okay. Or they're somehow slower, but they they, they shouldn't be slower. Actually, no. If they're uninvested, they would be slower, wouldn't they? They could be slower. 
All right, Bandstick, time to pop off. It is your battle now, Bandstick. Now, I have no idea what Colossus is going to do when it comes in. We're just going to have to figure that one out, but we'll see. Give me plus. Super Fang. Oh, you're a weirdo. But that actually means indeed he dies, which is super good for me right now. I'll take that. I'm, I'm down for that. Let's go. That's super Libby. So I was faster than Primarina, and they also didn't max it when they really had to. Although you don't want to max Primarina because uh, Liquid Voice does not affect Hyper Voice with the max move. It's still max strike because it's not sound based anymore. Bro, what a turn! What a turn! Let's go because we can kill the dead the dead end now without having to get uh, nuzzled. Scizor. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, they can't bullet punch me, which means they probably like. They're in a bad spot now. Between Ninetales and, uh... Between Ninetales and, uh... Colossal. Because Ninetales outspeeds Garchomp and kills it. And Colossal kills Scizor. And they can't bullet punch me. Um, I'm in a really good spot right now. And I'm gonna abuse that entirely. No, I have to follow me. I'm gonna follow me and I'm gonna go for the kill on Dedene. Just to get rid of it. Because it is kind of annoying getting nuzzled. I don't want to, you know, get paralyzed right now. I don't know what the worst thing they could do is. They just... Do they forget? Or are they like a Fury Cutter set? Or something. There's no... No, they didn't go for priority. Okay. Killed the Dene, it's a problem. And now we get to go Ninetales, because they probably like U-turned or something, and we're in a really good spot. Okay. We're in a fantastic spot. The Iron Headed. Are they like allergic to Dynamax or what is it? I don't understand. They have to be like allergic or whatever, right? They have to be. I'm gonna help a hand Hailstorm Scizor. Because I'm not worried about uh Ninetales at all. Or about guard drop at all because I have nine tails. So I'm gonna helping hand. And I'm gonna go for the the hailstorm. I guess I should just geyser smarter, and I have nine tails anyways. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I don't know why I was gonna go for hailstorm, because <laughs> uh, it, it, it is stab, but I think geyser is still stronger because it's neutral and not resisted. And then I can get the hail back with nine tails anyways, whenever I want. If I survive the turn, which I don't think I will. They might just forfeit, or I. They have to max Scizor here. Is my is my uh, thought process right? They have to max Scizor to win. So I want to get as much damage as I can on it, so I can win next turn with the uh, Blizzard. What would really suck right now is if they somehow airstream with Scizor. That would suck. Ooh, I spoke it into reality. I have a habit of doing that, of thinking and speaking things into reality. They're gonna airstream right now and boost Garchomp's speed. That's pretty bad. But Garchomp can't kill Ninetales. They shouldn't be able to anyways. Alright, I got the helping hand off, which is pretty good. They protected the Chomp, let's go! Okay, that's great, that's fantastic, i love to see that. Guys, are goodbye, Scizor! Look at the Bantic popping off. I'm plus two helping hand boosted. You're dead. You lived it because you're crazy. Oh my god. How did you do that? You're crazy. If they don't airstream, I'm vibing right now. They steal spike. They kill Bantic then, right? I love it. I love it. Okay. In that scenario, there's literally zero reason to not hit Bantic there. I guess like unless I max guarded. But I wasn't going to max guard. There's no reason to. Alright, that was a fantastic battle. That battle showed off exactly what I wanted to show off. This team popped off just now. To be fair, their team's a little bit weird. Like, it's, it's, it's kind of weird. But so was the last person's team that I won against. Hmm. So maybe it's not as good for the meta, but we have no proof saying that. So, I Oko a Primarina from full HP, okay? With a resisted move, okay? So relax, clowns, relax. Blizzard. Uh, liquidation should be the battle. Bop, knock him out real quick. Yo, Bertic went in just now. Bertic kind of lit. 
What a Pokemon! I'm glad I did the third battle too. I'm glad I had time. And goodbye, Garchomp. Even if you're Sash, you can't beat me. You're not Sash. Bro. Oh my god, the only way that battle could have gone a little bit better is if indeed he died faster. But even then, it might not have been a good idea. Because then they wouldn't have, like, they would have targeted Bear Tech and Dee. That could have been worse for me, honestly. But that's still, that was great. Colossus didn't even have to come to the field that, that, that battle. That was fantastic. Alright, well anyways, I'm going to call the video there. Thank you everybody for watching. Comment, subscribe, like, all that stuff, and I'll see you all in the next video. Later.